Last January, we found ourselves scrambling to find a studio in time that was within our budget. Uh, and we ended up finding the studio in Winnipeg, uh, a private ear recording studio with uh, the ever talented John Paul Peters. And uh, there we locked ourselves away for five weeks and uh, you know, had a blast hammering out this new album. I was lucky enough to be able to play on a grand piano on this album, which was a, a first for me. Spent a lot of time uh, getting used to the keys, finding that sweet spot with the mics. Had about five or six mics on the, on the grand. Ended up getting a really nice sound out of it. Not only did I spend quite a bit of time on the grand piano, but I also spent a good amount of time in the vocal booth, trying to keep up with Dave, doing harmonies, backup vocals. Uh, luckily, I had Dave himself and John Paul Peters uh, you know, coaching me through it. Uh, I definitely learned a lot and was happy with you know, all of our overall performances. I've been a part of quite a few recording projects over the years, uh, but they've definitely not been like the one that we just went through with JP. Uh, most of the time, we in the past, we'd be recording in basements with definitely some talented people, but just not with the types of resources that we had in recording at Private Year. Leading up to the recording of this album, we were obviously writing the album, and I, I was in a pretty interesting point in my life where I was expanding in terms of how I was thinking about things and trying to take on a bit more of a uh, positive viewpoint on, on many aspects of my life. And I was reading a, a lot of different books on stuff like philosophy and I guess mostly ph philosophical uh, readings. And took a lot of that influence and put it into the lyrics. And it was the first time since uh, very long ago that I had written in a personal manner and so it's created quite a connection between the songs that we recorded and, and myself.